Our sisterhood had a white elephant Hanukkah party last night that was really fun. And tomorrow uh -huh. they're, doing, they're calling it Hogwarts Hanukkah. It's Harry Potter trivia and a magician and dinner. And so oh wow. They're doing that actually on Sunday. So first night. Mm -hmm. so that's what's going on. Crazy. Lima, I have a question. Yeah. Right in the start. I'm gonna on page, you know, I was listening to recordings on page 57. Okay. I found something different than what I thought it okay. was. I don't know if you pronounced it wrong or maybe if I, I made a mistake. Yeah, I could it could be. But on line one, on the third word from the way you said, oh, I assumed it was a Hamatz Katan. Yes. But you pronounced it. The cow, the the cow, and there's no dot in the middle. So I put a dot in the middle, but I would have thought it right. would be so. The it's, cow. So the first line is vayachulu, vayichal, the coal, and mikol. Okay, so why is it a vikol if there's no dot in? The uh, it spot? should be. It should be vichol. You're right. It should be vichol. Sorry. Well, I made it the call so it would match your tape. <laughs> but I just that would just be okay. Possible, that's fine. Right? Yeah. And the other one I wondered went on line nine. Um, you said the first word was bay v, but she be oh, it's bay knee. Okay. Not to I'm criticizing. I just wanted to make sure I'm not missing something. No, it's fine. No, absolutely, absolutely. Yep. Okay. Any other questions? Okay. Page 63, I think we're up to. Yeah. And this is going to be um now we're just reviewing different things that are in Friday night prayers. So, um, okay, so Marcy, why don't you, oh God, I'm yawning today, I don't know why. It's very rainy and yucky here, so. Um, okay, so, uh, so why don't you start, Marcy, do the fur under the, so here they're showing you the bat versus the vet. Right there. So let's go through all the bets and then we'll go through all the vets. So if you want to do the first line under the bet, Marcy. Bene Aileen. Okay. Uh -huh. You know what? Why don't you do the first three? Let's, uh -huh. let's, oh, we no. don't go Question. around so much. Bene Aileen Mayin Rabin Kol Adonai. Bakiach? Bakoach. Oh, Bakoach. You got the O, oh, you got the Ach right, which is good. Because that's, <laughs> that's, that. that's one of our exceptions. So that's good. So, okay. And why don't you do the next two lines? And you're muted. Yep, she just put a finger up. She's getting it all together. I got, I got a <laughs> notification right across the part where I was supposed mm. to, you know, unmute. Sorry. <laughs> um, okay, so this Kol Adonai Beha Dar. Uh huh. Hish. Hish. Ta. Boo. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Le, oh, is there a vowel under that? It's it's la donai. It's la donai, right? So okay. it's le le bahat rat. Uh huh. Um, koresh. Kodesh. Kodesh. Sorry. Yep. So that's fine. Hishtachavu Ladonai Behadrat Kodesh. Okay. Hard one. 
All right, Sammy, take those last two lines. Okay. Um, Kol Adonai Yahil, or is it Yahil? Yeah. Uh huh. Um, Mid Bar mm -hmm. Yahil Adonai Mid Bar Kad. Kadesh. Yep, Kadesh. Perfect. Uh, Linda, why don't you take the first three lines of the vet? Avu, Ladanoi, Kavod, uh, Vao, Vaon, Havu, Ladanoi, Oz, Oz. Which one? Kavod. Shemo, Ale Hakabod, Hirim. Good. Uh, Karen, do you want to try the next couple lines? Uh, Al Hakabod, Hirah, Hirahim, Kedal Adonai. Show Var Al Ra Sim Oh, you want the next one too? <laughs> That's okay. No, I can do them. So let me do the okay. let me do the fourth line is Kol Adonai Shover Arazim. The fifth line, wait, one, two, three, four, five. The fifth line is Levanon Vesirion Kemo Vain Reemim. <coughs> okay, Marcy, you want to do the next two lines? Hot. Hmm. Is it hot? Uh, I think, that, is that save? Save? Save. Oh, oh, that's save. I don't have my contacts in today. Sorry. Oh, it's simple. <laughs> yeah, I should have put it in. La ha vote. H. Oh, do you want me to do another one? Yeah, do one more line. Okay. Uve a kalo. Uve uve a. No, Uvai Kalo. No. Uv, Uv, Hey, Kalo. Okay. It's the line before the you know, that's the I sound, right? Not the Correct. two. Correct. Okay. Sorry about that. Um, uh, Kulo, um, Omer, Kavod. Yeah, I'll go over that. Chotsev, Lahavot, Esh. Uv he halo hulo omer kavod. Okay. Anne, you want to try uh, the last two lines? I'll try, but you might have to take over. Take take okay. it slow. Um we so that's, right. a, that's the, it is, it's hard to see. It's a vav with the line under it. So it's vav. Oh, okay. Yeah. It looks like it three looks dots, like two dots. To me. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> that's okay. So it's Vayeshev. Vayeshev Adonai Melech Le Olam Adonai Yevavre at um amo va sha no you got it see uh adonai yevarech et amo va shalom okay so now on this these last three lines here they're taking the bet and the vet and they're showing you where you have lines in friday night prayers where you have the bet and the vet together so that you can uh, get used to seeing the two letters together. 
All right, Sammy, you want to try and take all three of those lines? Okay. Um, Avu, Leonai, Bene, Elim, mm -hmm. Baye, Sha, Bet, Bear, Arunai, Et, R, Z, Al, Van, no, 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 Halva, no. Yeah, Halva, no. No. Um, Arunai, Lama, Bull, Ya, Shev, Shav. Ya, Shav. Yep. Perfect. All right. So this is what we just read, leads us into the Friday night Mizmor La David. We also see this, by the way, um, when we're putting the Torah back on Sunday morning. So we say this Friday night, and we also say this when we put the Torah back Sunday mor Saturday morning, excuse me, I don't know why I said Sunday morning. Um, Saturday morning. So just so that you're aware. Um, different tunes, different whatevers. But okay, so this should be, it should be a little bit easier to do this since we just did reviewed some of some of the lines here. So, okay, Linda, why don't you take the first, uh, let's see. So even though this is split into columns, it's really goes right to left the whole line. Okay, so it's a poem, which is why you have different sentences, but the first line would be Havu la donai bene elim. Havu la donai kavod vaoz. And then we go to the next one. So, Linda, why don't you take the, la the last two and a half lines for that whole, let's do that, that stanza, let's okay. say. Havu la donai kavod shemo. Hishtachavu la donai behad rat. Kodesh, Adonai al Mayim Rabim. I think you skipped a line, but that's okay. Um, what did I skip? I think you skipped that third line, Kol Adonai. Okay. Kol Adonai okay. al Hamayim, El Hakavod Hirim, Adonai al Mayim Rabim. Perfect. All right. Karen, why don't you start uh, with the next line and get as far as you want to get with that? Call at a noy. Oops. Call at a noy. Bakoach. Bakoach. Call at a noy. Bahar. Dar. Call at a noy. Show. Vote. Var Ara Zone Vayo Shiver Adonai Alt Al Roads Hala Kono. Okay. Uh, so I'm going to, I'm just going to repeat it from the beginning. Kol Adonai Bakoach, Kol Adonai Behadar, Kol Adonai Shover Arazim, Vaishaber Adonai et Arze Halva Non. Tricky. Marcy, keep reading until you're ready to stop or I stop you. <laughs> okay. Um, the first, first, is that a line and then the two dots? I can't read it. It's it's Vayar Ki Dame. Okay, so it's a line in the two dots. Okay. Vayar Ki Dame. Kamo Egel Levanon Vasir Yon Kamo Vain. Vain. Oh, Vain. That's right. The book has the dot. I don't know why I keep mixing those up. Vain, re Re'emim. 
Let me keep going. Okay. No, we're good. Okay. And continue on. Um, Kol Adonai Hatsov Hatsev 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 Oh, I didn't see that little dot. Sorry. It's okay. Put on glasses. Um, <laughs> hold, hold, say, hold that with help. La have boat. Ish. Ish. Um, Ko uh -huh. Adonai. Ya. Ya heel. Mead. Bar. Ya, ya heel Adonai, mead bar, kadosh, kadesh. Kadesh, perfect. All right, Sammy, pick it up. Um, kol Adonai, yehol lel, lel, uh, uh, ya. Yaholel. Yeah. No. Yaholel. Uh-huh. Yaholel. I yell lot. Mm-hmm. By a a uh is there a vowel with that? Okay, so this is a tricky one. It's like one of these exceptions that happens very rarely. When you don't, when you have the sin and there's one dot, but no other vowels, you you assume that that dot is doing double duty as the sin and as the aw sound. Oh, okay. Veye uh, hey son or sof. Uh-huh. Yeah, it's wrote. Yeah, I wrote. Yeah, I wrote. Okay. So that's Vayeche Sof. Yeah, I wrote. Yeah, I wrote. Hard one. All right, Linda. Uvhe Chalo, Kulo, Amer, Kavod, Adonoi, Lama Bul, Yash. Yashav, Vyeshev, Adonoi, Mela, Laolam. Perfect. Karen, pick up that last line. Adonoi, Yos, Laamo, Ayitom, Adonoi, Yako, Yakot, At, Amo, Vashalom. Okay. Adonai oz le amo yitain. Adonai yevarech et amo vashalom. So, um, like I said, they will sing this on Friday night and then they will sing it again Saturday morning when they're putting the Torah away. Um, I want to say Friday night, they'll usually sing it. Havu ladonai bene elim, havu ladonai kavod vaoz, havu ladonai. Right? Um, and it'll just keep going that way. Um, on Saturday morning, sometimes they use the same tune, sometimes they use different ones. So I'm not even going to try to remember what it is. Um, okay. Page 65. Um, this is preparing you for Adon Olam on page 66. So some of the words are going to sound familiar because they are, um, they are from Adon Olam. So what they're trying to do here, uh, if you look at the box at the top, the chet, the chaf, and the final chaf all make the same sound, the chachacha. Ch, ch. The k sound is the one with the dot in it. And then that last one's a samech, but sometimes it gets confused for a kaf or a chaf. So they're trying to give you all of these things 
as many words as they can with those in them so that you can practice and, and know the difference, okay? All right, Marcy, start us off. Do uh, the first line. The safe soul, the ah, ray, ahered, ahad, lahak, lahak, bira. Yep. Okay, Anne. Um, lecha, hev, hev. B. Mm hmm. Ruhi. Ruhi. Yeah, same word. I don't know why they did it. The first one's Vichai. I didn't, I don't know if that's what I heard, but I just wanted to make that clear. No, okay. you didn't hear that. <laughs> all right. All good. All good. Again, remember the purpose of this course is so that you can follow along. So I'm not expecting you to have 100% reading. Uh, capabilities, right? If you want to move on to a adult bar mitzvah, bat mitzvah class or something like that, then yeah, you, you know, you'll practice more, but, but for this purposes of this class, um, if you could find where you, where you're supposed to be at, that's all that matters. Um, I just think that reading it out loud helps reinforce what, what you're seeing. Um, so that's why I have you read out loud, but I also let you opt out if it's not what you want. But I think, and every time you're like, well, I don't know, you do it every single time. So <laughs> I think you're doing great. Do not worry. Thank you. Okay, Thank you. Sammy, take that next line starting Malach. Malach, Melech, Yim, Loch, Koch, Lot. Kich, Lot. Oh, yeah, see, Ki. Kich Lot. Good, um, good. Ach Lit. Perfect. All right, Linda, take that next line. Al Kol Hakol um, Kosi. Okay. So that was Kol Kol Hakol Kosi. Okay. Karen, try that last line. Is that a Hamat uh, Katan? Excuse me. Is that because you said Kol and she said Kal? Is that a Hamat Katan? The first one is coal. So it is. Yep. I want to mark that. Okay. Whoops. Uh, Nami. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Yo, ma. No. No. Coma. That's an S, isn't it? That's a Sama. Yep. Yeah, co-sing, sing. Yep, and that's it, exactly that. So it's nisi umanos ki, uh, sorry, kosi. That, the second word, manos, that samach a lot of times will be confused for the memsofit. So that, I think that's why they put it in there. They want you to recognize the difference between the, the samach and the, uh, the memsofit. So, um, so they put it in there. Okay. So now they want to show you the rhymes because Adon Olam is a rhyme, right? It's a poem that rhyme, that has a rhyming uh, uh, pattern to it. So they want to show you what the rhymes are. So if you would just, when I call on you to read the line, read the word in the box and then read the line that's there. Um, and we'll go from there. Okay, Marcy, go for it. Nivra, Asher, Malach, Aza, Melech, Shmo, Nikra. Right. That third word is Azai. Don't forget the 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 line with the oh, Yud. I, I thought it was two dots. So that's a line there. Yeah, it's a line. Yeah, okay. yeah. It's a it's a bad it's a bad copy of the book. So. Okay. <laughs> But we have permission to use it, so we do. <laughs> okay. Um, so we had Nivra. Now we have Nikra. Anne, you want to read that line that goes with Nikra? Sure. Nikra. Leha. Do. 
Yim. Lev. That's again bad copy of the of of it. It's levado. It's a uh, it's a vav. That's a vet. Excuse oh, me. Okay. So it's just that it does look very. It looks very bad. So okay. The next one, uh, Sammy, we're going to do is no ra. Ra. B. Um, gosh, this is a. That's a tet. I think it's kind of cut off at the top, but it's a tet. A tet? Okay. <clears throat> um, be te rem. Mm -hmm. Call. Mm -hmm. It's ear. Um, Neve. Ra. Neve ra. That's also a vet. So. And good for recognizing the coal. Like I said, 99.9% .9 of the time, this is going to be the Kamatz Katan. So, oh. okay. Um, I'm, I'm confused as to what they're doing here. Like these rhymes are not in the lines that they're showing. The first one was, and then it stopped. So I almost want to just go to Adon Olam on page 66 and point them out to you where it, where it rhymes because I don't know what they're trying to do here. Um, but look, go to page 66. If you look at the last word of, of all the lines, right? You've got Nivra, Nikra, Nora, Betifa Ra, Lehach Bira, Vehash, Veha Misra, Sara, Ekra, Ve'a'ira, and Ira. So that's where they're showing you the ra, ra, ra is all at the end of each of the words of Adon Olam. I'd rather just read this. Let's do that. <laughs> okay. Um, Where were we? Linda, why don't you start? Adon Olam Asher Malach Biterim Kal Kal Yitzir Nivra. Perfect. Go ahead, Karen. Liet Naasa Ziha Ziha Fots Kol Azain. So that that one's a tricky one. Ve ha so. The right. so. Mm hmm Kol azain mele shemo nikra. Here we go. And this is where Marcy's like, I know it. I know it. Yeah. <laughs> and so it's very, it's very important just to make sure we're just saying mm -hmm. it right. So I'm really proud that you said na asa because. When we sing it, we say nasa, right? We kind of like blend it all together. But when you read it, it's na asa. Okay, go ahead, Marcy, with the achare. Which which line are we on now? Third, lost... The third line of Adon Olam. The achare kivlok kivlot at Paul. Sorry, I won't answer it. Le varo le varo yimlo. Right. So the achare kich lot hakol levado yimloch no ra. All right, Anne, go ahead with the next line. Um ye yeah. ya or va? It's va. Okay. The the ho the who? Yep. Ha at hi ya. Oh hi ya. The who ha ne ha ne ha ne ho ho ve. Uh, okay, let me see the little dot. Are okay. you on the fourth? You're on the fourth line. Okay, good. Yeah, <laughs> believe it or not, yes. Oh, the. Oh, good. It's all good. The. 
who ye at ye ye the tea the tea ba ra. You got it. Okay. Sammy, next line. Behu Betar Betad Echad. Oh, Echad. That's a, that's a, that's an it, not a tit. Nope, that's an olive. No, I meant, um, it looks, oh, it looks like a tit. I mean, a, the first it, letter? No, the second word. Second word, the, the second first letter. Word. Second the letter. Second letter. No, that's a chet. The who echad. <clears throat> As opposed to a top you're line. saying? There's not a space there it, on my copy. It looks like a tad instead of a had. Gotcha. But it's a had. It's yeah. a Okay. Um, the in she ni le had. Leham, seal, shield, lo, yeah. seal, lo, lehad, leha, he, leha, um, be ra, yeah, be ra, leha, be ra, ah, be ra. There okay. you go. All right, Linda. <laughs> Bali Rashit, Bali Tahlit, Bilo Haoz, Beha Mish Misra. Perfect. All right, Karen. Jahu Ali Vata Ali Vehai. The high go Ali with Ava low the eight. So, uh, yeah, Vetsur have Lee be eight Sarah. Okay, Marcy, continue on. Behu Lisi Umanos Li Menach Kosi Bayom Akra 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 And the first word is Menat. That's a tough, not a tough. Okay. Yep. Yep. Okay. And so yeah, do uh up could off keyed. Okay, off keyed roof the eight ish. Ishan, the ah, uh, the ha, the I, the ah, uh, e ra. Yep, that's one of the hardest words in this whole thing. The ah e ra. All right, Sammy, finish it up for us. Aim Ru He Gay Ri Ya T Arunai Li Belo E Rot. You got it. Yeah. 
What's the thing? So a Donal alum has like, you know, hundreds and hundreds of tunes, but I'll try and do a slow one um, so that you can follow, just follow along as I, as I say it. Vehu ihi ebeti fara, vehu echad ve ein shemi, leham shilo lehach bihira, beli reishit, beli tahlit, velo ha oz veha misra, vehu eli vechai goali. Vetuhavli so, um, so if you could follow along with that, then, you know, and again, this is probably one of the more um, recognized, you know, I think Shema is the most recognized, but Adon Olam is probably the next most recognized. It's, um, you know, it's sung Saturday morning at the end of the service, sometimes Friday night at the end of the service. So even if you don't get there on time, usually you get to hear this. Um, so, okay. Um, pages 67 and 68 are just kind of a summary of the alphabet. Gives you the names of the alphabet, like Aleph, Bet, Gimel, Dalit, Hey, right? Um, and then on page 68, I don't know if this helps or hurts. So if you start to look at it and it's confusing, then just skip it. But it's trying to show you the groups of letters that are similar in one way or another. So Aleph, Ein, and He are silent letters. He only at the end of the word is silent. Aleph, Ein, and Tariq all kind of look alike. And so they're trying to give you that. Um, and then throughout, they're giving you, you know, all the Sophit letters, um, you know, and they're trying to give you ways of kind of, you know, if you're confused about something, being able to look at this page and go, okay, I remember Samach and Mem are not, Mem and Sophie are not the same, they're different, and here's how they're different, and that sort of thing. Um, and then um, page 70. Um, I think here they're trying to give you some um, so they're going into, let's say, Lechuna Ranana, and they're trying to give you some of the harder words to show you where they fit in the prayer and that sort of thing. Um, again, I don't know that you need that. Um, and I mean, I think that's what they're doing in, in some of these. Um, even like page 72 is a psalm we say on Friday night, but it's not one that we all say together, right? So I don't know why they have that in there other than, you know, to give you, again, this, this whole book is about Friday night. So I think they're trying to give you more and more insight on, on the Friday night service and the Hebrew that's in it. I don't know that you necessarily need that, right? Um, what's in the box at the bottom is what the cantor will sing. So if you want to find your place, um, but usually in the Sim Shalom and the New Lev Shalem, there's a box or a little red triangle when the cantor is, you know, is continuing at the end of, you know, a psalm. And so I don't know that you necessarily need those. Um, same with Orza Ruan 73. So this is nice for practicing your Hebrew, but I prefer you open up the Sidur and just, you know, practice there, like open up to what you know and, and practice from that. Um, 
Yeah, that's it. Um, I, you know, I'd rather, um, I'd rather um, spend time on, let's say, Friday night home service, right? Like, like Kiddish and Mosi and that sort of thing. So I think what I want to do is so, oh, oh, okay. So today's our last class. Um, I'm continuing this class at 1.30 for advanced beginner, which is the next level starting in, I think it's February. And um, there's not going to be a formal sign up. I'm just going to send out an email. You'll tell me if you're continuing on. And then if I have room, then some other people from other classes might join us, but we're not going to do a formal sign up. Um, because they're trying to reevaluate and give more classes and different kinds of classes. So they're, I think, taking a semester off from offering new sessions, but they want everybody that wants to continue to continue. Um, <clears throat> but I do want to have it. I want, before we start the formal session, I want to have a session in January, maybe early February, something like that. A, because I don't want you to go too long without having practiced. And B, um, like I said, I think we should review the Friday night you know, kiddish, mozi, blessing your children. Um, you know, we can even do Birkat zone, like that sort of thing. Um, just to do a little bit of review um, before we start. The advanced beginner class is actually picking up your, getting getting your Sidur. There's no like formal book. It's getting your Sidur and going through the Saturday morning service. That's the Sidur um, Lev Shalom? Is that uh, the either Lev Shalom or Sim Shalom. I have page numbers for 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 all three books for the 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 small seam shalom, the big seam shalom, and the lev shalom. So if you have a sidur in your house, that's fine. If not, I'll provide you a link to uh, an online seam shalom sidur that you could follow along. Um, um, that's what I did for this for this semester's class. Um, so keep practicing. If you have any questions, reach out to me. I'm happy to get on a quick phone call or Zoom call with you to review something that you you know that you're having trouble with or whatnot. Are you going to post any more recordings of any of these pages that we tell want? Tell me. Tell me what you want, Marcy. I'm happy to make recordings. Oh, I'll, <laughs> you know, I'll, I'll take whatever yeah. you want to do. <laughs> I, I don't have a. Yeah, did you see the link I sent you in the last email? Right. Um, this is a very helpful site for me, at least. Let me find, uh, here we go. So let me, give me one second. Hold on. Do, do, do. While you're looking for that, I just want you to know that I love this class, but I'm going to be in, we leave for New Zealand and Australia and Tasmania and Lizard Island for five weeks oh, wow. on February 3rd. So I'll be on the other side of the world. So amazing. Amazing. What an amazing trip. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. It's our 47th anniversary trip. Wow. Oh, fantastic. That's amazing. Amazing. Good. I'm going to Disney World in March for a week, and I bet you it's going to cost almost as much as you trip because Disney World's gone nuts with its prices. That's crazy. Uh, not quite. I'm, be I'm being facetious, but right. <laughs> that's wonderful. All right. So reach out to me if you need anything. I will send an email in a week or so when they formalized when they're starting the next semester, that sort of thing. Um, oh, I was going to tell you. So this, what I sent out last week, this Lehrer Communications link. Um, I got that. Yeah, let me show it. Let me let me show you. Hold on. Um, let me share my screen. I was trying to get. I have a prettier one, but I'm I'm going to send a better link than this. But let me just show you. So here you've got. Um, this is oh yeah i didn't get that so for example if i go into friday night mariv right 
um, here's Alenu, and it comes up with a. Alenu Right. So I like those links because you can listen to the prayer the way the cancer does it and be able to follow along in your sidur in your in your book. So I'm going to send that out again. And the main page looks a lot prettier than that. Um, I don't know why when I just pulled it up, it, it, it comes to that. But I use that. Um, I use that a lot. Like if I'm leading services, I'll use that to be like, oh, what? What's the tune for that? What's the tune for that? And I'll, I'll listen to them and I'll listen for all that. But it's very good also to be able to follow along in the sidur of this prayer or that prayer. And so for my advanced class, I just point them there and I say, okay, here's what we're going to go over. And then they practice it with this tape, with this um, MP3 to be able to, you know, to be able to follow along. Because again, we're just trying to follow along. We're not trying to read it with it. And you also can, let me go back. Let me see if I could share that again. If you go over here, playback speed. You can make it. Oh, okay. Right. So you can do the speed slower or faster, but the slower one, you could then sing it with them and follow along. You know what I mean? Um, so I, so I like that. And I use that with my advanced beginner class, instead of me recording all of, you know, of the entirety of Shacharit, um, for Friday morning, for a Saturday morning or the entirety of Musa. Um, cause that's what they want. They want to, you know, they want to know. And this is because this is, a this is for practicing Nusach, which is the tune, they're going to skip over what they normally would skip over when they lead it in services. So that's good too. Um, you just have to, you know, be aware of where they're going to skip to and that sort of thing. And that's where it gets a little tricky that you're like, well, where are they next? When You froze. <laughs> Lee, where you froze if you can hear. Okay, I uh, I guess I got kicked off, but I got I got brought back. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, okay. all right. Well, everyone have a happy Hanukkah. Uh, happy New Year. A healthy Thank New you. Year. Yeah. And I, I, will have, send um, I have one other Kevin question. Answer. You, I'm sorry. I know you recorded a lot of these and they're on the Women's League website. Since it's a long break, do you think it might be advantageous to go back, to go and listen to not only, well, your recordings, but some of the other recordings from some sure. of the courses just to keep it? absolutely can listen to other recordings. And if you find, and I'll be honest, if you find a teacher that you like better than me, I, I don't care. You know, you can ask me, you know, you can uh, contact me or you can contact Julia Loeb, who runs this program, to say, hey, I'd like to be in their class next semester. Where do, you know, where, when do they meet that sort of thing? Because all the teachers are really open to having new kids, new students in their class and new, um, you know, and, and, and move things around. Um, so, you know. I think, I think you're really a great teacher. And for my B'nai Mitzvah, that's what I did is I kept listening to the tapes and reading the prayer book while, until I could get them all down. Right, right. So that's, so that's the key. Um, and that's what we do in the next, in the next, in the advanced beginner is we learn Saturday morning and we talk about the prayers and we, you know, we go through, um, and we go through them and read them. And then I, and then I point to this website for uh for everyone to kind of listen to it um to get familiar with it so if you've never been to shul on saturday or if you go in frequently this gets you more comfortable if you've been then and you go then you might not need to listen to the recordings because you're going every saturday and you can follow along in the c door so 
You know, I got an answer for your questions last week from my Israeli yes. student. Oh, please. She said that the Siddur usually has the vowels and um, that kids stop using vowels in the second grade. Oh, jeez. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Pretty advanced. There you go. Well, I guess then I'm a second grade reading level because I don't think I can ever. <laughs> Great. I'd never do this without the vowels unless I was memorizing it for a Torah portion or something. Right. right. And that's what you do with the Torah portion. You you end up memorizing it. Um, you know, and there are there are words that if they had different vowels would be other words. And sometimes I make the assumption that it's one word versus another. And I'll actually like sit there. Actually, I actually am reading Torah on Sisterhood Shabbat, but it's a long one. So I actually have my thing printed out and I'll write down, you know, I'll like circle or I'll underline what, you know, is something that I need to remember because it's so difficult, you know? So. Well, thank all you right, for all well, right. thank Just you. Reach out if you need anything. I'm always here. Hey, okay, thank you. <laughs> thank you very so much. much. Thank you very yeah. much. You're a great teacher. Thank you so much. I agree. Bye. -bye.